Hi guys, I am so sorry I'm late. I was actually on another program and I showed up late to their program, so I felt bad. So I, was, I hung around and it was fun. It was a lot of fun. So I was on Nana Tink Adventures and Adventures in Re Oh my gosh, Nana Tink Adventures? Nana Tink, I, I think it's so. And Adventures in Reselling. And they have a, a show on Thursday nights and it's really fun. They interview somebody and they ask questions and people win prizes. So it was a lot of fun. Hi, <clears throat> hi to everybody that's out there. Hope you're doing well. I'm a little tired today. It's already 9.25. Again, I apologize for being so late. I think, you know, I was going to do ice cream shoes, but I don't know. I'm tired. Honey, I'm back. Hi, Mary Brown. Hi, Cindy. Effie, Sun Arts. Hi, Annie. So, hi. So peachy tonight. Thank you. Go Fish Global. And I'm so sorry I was late. Go Fish Global. And Chris and Danica, so I, I might I might try my 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 thing that I wanted to try, but do you guys want to do the raffle for the Halloween hop first? Hi, Larry. Does everybody want to do that first? We can do that first. I will do that first. Let's do that first. So I am on a random contest thingamajigger. I don't know if you can see it. You can see it somewhat. Look, look, it's Inception. There you go. Uh, and I'm going to run. So it's picking all of the comments, everybody who commented on all the videos for the Halloween hop. All righty. And I had, I think, like 30 people that commented on all the videos. So ready? We're going to pick that first. And this is for the $75 Amazon gift card. And this is thanks to Sandy McKenzie Lumbermill, who also chipped in to make it a bigger prize. And the random winner is Renters Love Luxury by, what is it? Let's see her channel. Renters Love Luxury by N. Cool. So she is the winner. I want to thank her and everybody that was part of the Halloween hop. You guys made it fun. Is she here? Is she here at all? Hi, everyone. Hey, KJ. So it was fun on the other channel. It was a lot of fun. Congrats. Yes, yeah, so I have to make sure I send her an email and tell her that she won. If she doesn't respond by Saturday or Sunday, we'll draw again. But you guys saw all the names go by, right? Peanut Butter, 52. How are you doing? 524. Scully Star Fashions. Congratulations. All right, so... This is what I originally wanted to do. I don't know. I don't know if I can do it. Oh, geez. Do I have a scissor? Do I have a scissor here? Please tell me I have a scissor close by. I thought I had a scissor here. Hold on. I always have something. I always have something going on. I have too many things going on this week, guys. You must forgive me. I have a scissor. I knew. Sorry. I knew I had a scissor. So what I wanted to do was practice on my project that I'm going to do for plaid paints. So I've told you that they are going to feature me as one of their artists. And I had an idea for something that I want to do. And that's something. Where's my stuff? Oh, it's over here. And that something has something to do with shoes and a certain decoration that I want to have for Christmas this year. You love my shirt. Thank you so much. So I'm taking, so these are some ratty shoes that I had around the house. And I said, if I mess them up, I mess them up. Who cares? But I just wanted to try out making ice cream shoes. So if you look at my shoes, you can see they're nasty. Let me use the other one because I want to paint over that. So these are my nasty painting shoes. This has paint too, but it doesn't matter. I'm going to be covering it. But see how it looks like waffle? It looks like a waffle cone. Isn't that cute? So the first thing I'm going to do with the waffle cone is just make those indentations a little thicker or a little deeper or a little darker. Love my shirt. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I am very peachy. Peachy keen. And remember, we have I have a very busy weekend. So tomorrow night, I have a battle with 
Victoria. And by the way, welcome everyone. If this is your first time here, thank you for joining my channel. I have gunk on my finger and I can't get it off because I have nowhere to do it and I don't have my painting shoes on. Oh well, I'll just do it on the other pair of shoes. If this is your first time here, welcome so much. Thank you for joining us. And um, basically, my channel is just a lot of fun with a lot of friends. Now I gotta cut this. Um, so if you're new here, please let us know so somebody can drop your channel. So you can all get to know each other. Oh, there, that one came out better. So what I'm gonna do first is I'm just going to, because this already has lines, all I have to do is darken these lines just, wow. This is actually the exact, oh, wow. This paint is the exact same color. And this is plaid, plaid FX. It is the exact same color of this shoe. Whoa, pretty much. So I'm just going to cover those little, look at this. Wow. Wow. I didn't even realize that. It's a little darker. Not too much, but just a little darker. All right, well, there, there you go. I fixed that. <laughs> I need a darker brown. A little darker brown. Uh, now keep the shoes, right? <laughs> No, I'm, I, I still want to use these shoes as my test because I've always wanted these ice cream shoes. I don't know. Have you ever seen these ice cream shoes that are out there? It's really cool. Just darkening it a little bit. I'm not going to go over the whole shoe. I'm just going to do the front just to get an idea of what I want to do. But what I want to do, these are going to be ice cream shoes because it already looks like a cone, like a waffle cone. I want to have gingerbread shoes for Christmas this year. But see how that's already looking like a waffle cone? It's going to be messy. It's going to be messy. I can fix it with the other paint. So I just basically want to do the tip. I just want to do the tip. I'm so sorry. <laughs> You've never seen ice cream shoes? Oh my gosh, guys, look it up on Instagram. Look up ice cream shoes. They are the cutest things. And they're super expensive. These shoes would go for like 300 bucks. I kid you not. So how are you guys all doing? Is this real ice cream? No, it's not real ice cream, sweetie. It's fake ice cream. It's going to look... It's going to look like my shoes are made of ice cream. <clears throat> like an ice cream sundae. Everybody drop your links. So I was on their channel and it was so cute because it was like a game show. They ask me questions first. They do a quick little interview and then they ask me questions. And then they try to gauge like, you know, if I had, if and never have I ever done this or that or the other. Everybody always thinks I'm some wild maniac kind of woman or something. I wonder why you get that idea, right? So I just want to chill. Hi, Victoria. She's here. Hi, Susan. <clears throat> Larry, have to go. We'll catch up the replay. No problem. No problem. Somebody share Creative Crafty Girl's channel. She's trying to get subscribers. And I'm fine with that. Most people, I mean, etiquette-wise, you're not supposed to be like, hey, come to my channel, but that's okay. I don't mind because here we're trying to build community. We're trying to help each other out. So you see? It's not perfect, but again, this is a test run. I'm, gonna, I'm trying to do this quick also, so it's a little messy, but it's okay because the decorations are going to cover it up. How is everyone doing Thursday night? What a busy day. I had to be, I was like in two playlists. I'm never going to do that again. I literally, I mean, it was too much. And the thing with me, I don't know about you, but for me, <clears throat> if you're going to be in a playlist, if I'm going to be in a playlist, I have to watch everybody else's submission because I just feel that's only fair, you know? Not only that, but it drives those people to your channel as well. 
Because I've noticed that not everybody does that. Like, it's like, it should make sense that if there's 25 um, people in the playlist, you should have at least 25 views on, on, your, on your video. But not everybody plays the same way. I know it's a little messy. That's okay. But it's starting to look like, you know, it's starting to look like a waffle cone. This paint is fabulous, by the way, because it stretches. It's, um, <clears throat> I'll fix those parts that I overdid, whatever. I, over, I overlapped the line. Um, it stretches. It's, it's a flexible acrylic paint. I've never heard of that except for this acrylic paint. I also have shoe paint. But this acrylic paint should do just fine because it's flexible and it adheres to everything. <clears throat> you have watched playlists all night. Please, I need help. Oh, yes. If anybody knows how to how to change a banner on a channel, please get in touch through I through Instagram. With uh hi, have you checked Canva? Yeah, there you go, Canva. See, and somebody made it for me as a gift, like literally, like it was a birthday gift. And I don't have the heart to ever change it again because it was a gift. That's that's how I am. Not only that, I think I look cute. All right. It has all my characters, my main characters on there. All right, so look. There you go. It already looks like a waffle cone. Now, I'm going to leave this out. I think the other one looks, this more looks more chocolatey. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some of this pearlized. No, I'm going to use this. So let's see if this works. I might need a stick. So I'm going to use one of these bottles. And I'm going to use... Now, <clears throat> this is the difference I want to show you. This is caulk. This is caulking. This is more cement-like. This is silicone. So if you're going to do this, you have to use silicone because it stretches, it adheres better. The other thing would, would the other one would crack. So don't use that. Use this. It's probably a dollar more. It probably costs like a dollar ninety nine for something like this. Now I want to put it in here because I want to mix this with the glitter Mod Podge. I hear if you put. There you go. Everybody's talking about Canva. That's good. I'm going to mix this with some glitter Mod Podge. Let's see if that's enough. And I forgot to get my piping bag, but for this example, I'm just going to use this. I'm not going to use a piping bag. Cover this right away. I don't have a computer right now, so I'm struggling. Oh, no, you're kidding. I'm sorry to hear that. Oops. I missed a spot right here. And this dries so incredibly fast. Look, it's already dry. It's incredible. All right, now I'm going to use the back of this brush. I'm going to put a little bit of this Sparkle Mod Podge just because I like it. It's cute. And I've also heard that this helps the caulking be a little more fluid is to add a little bit of Mod Podge. Did you know that? Or glue or white glue. I'll clean it later. All right. <laughs> I'm lucky that this has like a sponge, so I'm just wiping my fingers off of it. <laughs> Oop. Trying to get it to the bottom. And then we are going to do this. Interesting. Ooh. Oh, 
I didn't expect it to go out like that. That's interesting. Are the, are the bottoms in? Oh, it's like glue. Oh, squeeze bottle out. Okay. okay. We'll do it anyway. Hey, Nana Tink. This is not what I expected, but oh well. That's okay. We will work with this. So what I'm going to make this look like is like I'm going to make this look like it's like like frosting. Frosting or ice cream. You know what? I might have to use I might have to use the caulking directly and then just paint it with the Mod Podge after because this is going to take forever. I should have prepped it before him. But look how it's already looking like, like it's ice cream. I think this is better, just going straight. And I'll add the glitter afterwards. And yes, this will stick onto your shoe. You have to let it dry, but yes, this will stick onto your shoe. I'll open this tip a little more. But I wanted to practice before Saturday because, you know, it's a big deal. It's a big deal. So I wanted to see how these turned out. I want to see if I got the technique pretty much done right. And, of course, <clears throat> I'm going to use, like, actual cake tips and stuff like that. Where's Davida when you need her, right? She's like the – she's like the, the – the faux cake person here. Look how cute. And yes, I will wear these. <clears throat> you better believe it, especially if I made it, I'm gonna wear it. But it doesn't look like vanilla ice cream, doesn't it? Ooh, it looks yummy. Oops, something fell. <laughs> I'm just gonna go all around the rim here. And this is such a cute idea. If you have little girls, please make this. Nana Tink, it was so much fun to be on Nana Tink Treasures. It was so much fun being on your channel. And I'm sorry, I was so involved with work and with the, 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 play, the playlist that I had to put stuff on today. I didn't announce it enough, but I'm glad that I, I announced it while I was there on your channel so that people could go and join, join you from my channel. And it was fun. I enjoyed it. I wish I could do it again. If you ever need me to do it again, I will do it in character. Oh, this is so cute. I love it. Am I overdoing it? Is that too much ice cream? It's an ice cream shoe, Annie. It's supposed to have a lot of ice cream. All right, now watch this. This is cool. I know you would have been a great nun. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. I know everybody thinks I'm this wild. I mean, I know I have this persona of like being wild and outrageous, but I'm very shy. I'm so shy. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. No, I'm not. So I thought, how cool would it be to use like beads as sprinkles? Right? Right? Yes, I'm going to put cherry and sprinkles. Of course.
course, Lizzie. Well, Lizzie's another one for like good faux stuff. I was a very good girl growing up. I was a very good girl. I was a youth minister. I'm still a good girl. Love baby Jesus. <laughs> Good night, Rosalie. Love you. I'm sorry. My work area is so messy. I was trouble when you were a kid, really. <clears throat> I never gave my mom a moment's worry. I would do my homework. I would do, I was a good girl. Just as my sons are, they're good boys. Very, very blessed. All right. Night Effie. Is Effie leaving? Night Rosalie. Oops. That would have been a mess. <clears throat> I am thirsty tonight. Why did this not want to open? Oh my gosh, this is so difficult to open. All right. I'm trying to do this before it dries. Hopefully it didn't dry too much. <clears throat> there we go. Can you see the sprinkles? Yeah, I can't see the sprinkles. I gotta fix that over there. <clears throat> I am so sorry. Excuse me. I don't know why. I, I you got it. I'm so afraid of like opening this rough and then it all spills all over the place. <clears throat> they don't want to stay. It like dried up too quickly. I don't need a lot. I just need a few. <clears throat> Do not try to follow any. You will be lost. Why? Why do you say that? I'm doing it in front of you. There we go. And some blue ones. But I thought this was a, a cute idea with the little seed beads. Use them as sprinkles. And I have the bugle beads also. What is this? I'm just pushing it in. I don't want to push it in too much because then it loses its little, its little. Here we go. And then, just trying to make it look like, like frosting almost. Then, <clears throat> the pièce de résistance, as they say. Right there. Put a little dollop. <clears throat> I am sorry, I keep like... And then these cherries, believe it or not, they have them at the Dollar Tree. I don't know if I want it that long in there. And then, yeah, put the cherry right there. And there you have it. <laughs> 
It looks cute. I'm going to put some chocolate now if you wanted to. You can, I'll get a little bit of this and I can put like strawberry or chocolate. Maybe I should make some strawberry. Let's do that. Give a little bit of white. Oops. Sunday shoes, exactly. I'm going to put a little bit of strawberry underneath. The white, just a little, just a touch. And you can make it, you can make it like a little drops. <laughs> I would wear these. I would, I would, why not? Life's too short. It's nice to have, you know, fun, funny things, make people smile. Because that's what some people look at you like you're ridiculous. And other people will just look at you and say, oh, that's cute. I always want to be that person that inspires somebody else to be a little more daring, you know, a little more adventurous. How's it look? Life is too short and there's too much sadness and too much strength that if you can bring a little bit of joy into somebody's, even if it's at the cost of somebody thinking you look ridiculous, who cares? Somebody else saw you and made them smile. What do you think? I like it. That's why I put the foam in here so I can hold it. Good morning, America. Hi, cute. I want some. They're darling. Right? But I wouldn't pay $300. No, I wouldn't pay $300 for them either. Not if I could make them. Heck no. And you can make them however you want. If you like strawberry, if you like chocolate, if you like pistachio. Ooh, pistachio. Oh, that would have been cute with like mint green. All right, I'm starting my new business, guys. Because this is a lot of fun. I could see some, the guy who made, it was a guy who came up with this. He is making a bundle, I'm telling you. It's called Shoe Bakery. Look it up. But there are a lot of like creators. Now mine's going to be a little different because it's going to be holiday themed. So the one that I'm going to do for Plaid that's going to premiere on November 21st. And I'm going to be live being interviewed by Plaid. Scary. Um, at the same time. While they're viewing my video for the first time. So that's why tomorrow I am not. I'm not even going to do the Hallmark and chill tomorrow night, guys. It's just too much for me this weekend. I have Kiss on Sunday, Keep It Simple Sunday with Melissa. So I'm going to keep it simple with my own life and not try to do so, so many things. I have Connie. I have Connie Sunday night. So Saturday night, I'm taking a break. I'm not going to do Hallmark and chill. And Friday, I'm going to do the, so Connie, I have Connie with a battle with me on Sunday night. And tomorrow, I have Victoria from uh, Tea Time with Coco and Alo with Aloha and Coco. Oh, 
I'm getting hungry now. Oh, good. I'm glad. Ooh, ice cream purse. Yes, I do have a purse. I do have a purse that I'm going to also make into an ice cream purse. Is that enough, guys? What do you think? I think that's good for now. Look at how cute. Needs a little more texture over here. I really like that. See, see the other side? I think the other side came out a little better. How cute is this, guys? I love it. So the only thing I'm going to add is more sprinkles. I think I have to glue them on or something, and I will be done. So thank you, guys. This was a quick, this was a quick one. This was a quick one, but um, where's my pink one? There's my pink one. I don't want them to fall out, but I just wanted to show you, like, what I got to, um, so you can have, like, a little preview of what I'm actually... Carlos! Oh my gosh, Carlos, how are you? Carlos is my brother. I love you. He's the one I'm going to go visit in Tallahassee. Look, Carlos, look what I made. Everybody say hi to Carlos. The plaid interview is going to take place on Saturday, September. Yeah, Saturday, September. Oh my gosh. Saturday, November 21st. I'm actually going to be up in Tallahassee with Carlos. Hi, Melissa. So, Carlos, uh, at noontime Saturday, uh, we can't do anything because I have to be interviewed by Plaid. So, I was just, <laughs> oh, it's Bianca. It's my niece. Bianca, what are you doing up so late? Well, it doesn't matter, right? You go to school at home. How are you, Bianca? You like my ice cream shoes? Bianca, do you want me to make you ice cream shoes? No. Okay. She's my beautiful little niece. Bianca, do you, do, you don't want ice cream shoes? <laughs> I, I would have fun making you ice cream shoes. She's 10. I would think she would want ice cream shoes. She's really smart. Oh, my goodness. She's really smart. But, yeah, I'm going to be up there. And so that Saturday that I'm up there, guys, I'm going to be interviewed. So it's going to be – the interview is going to be live on – their Facebook page. So I am nervous. I'm hoping that they like what they see. And, you know, being a featured creator is a great, I don't know, honor. I, they don't do this with just every, anybody. So <laughs> no, she doesn't want ice cream shoes. Okay, fine. <laughs> Melissa, I'll make you some ice cream shoes. I just keep putting more ice cream. The thicker the paint, the better, because that way it looks more like, you know, like pretty. Like what I should have done, and this is what I'm learning. This is a learning experience. I should have mixed the paint with the spackle, just the red paint with the spackle, and then made it look like more like ice creamy. But it looks like melted ice cream, which is what I want. So, tier 56. But I want it on gym shoes. I know somebody else, I had a friend come over and she's like, oh, I want to see how you make ice cream shoes today. And I'm like, well, and she wanted them on sneakers. So I got to figure out how to do that on sneakers. <laughs> but on these ballerinas and these, these shoes are so cheap. These are like nine bucks. So anyway, you're a size 10 too. Okay, cool. Very cool. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Please give me a thumbs up. Again, tomorrow we have the Epic Craft Battle with, uh, it's a Disney-themed Epic Craft Battle. It should be a lot of fun. There will be singing involved. Please realize that because I love Disney. And so, yeah. Thank you, Lone Star Picker. Yes, please hit the hit the thumbs up and the subscribe button if you haven't subscribed to me before. Subscribe to me before. And I want to thank you all again for your patience for being here a little later than usual because I was, you know, on the other show, on Nana Tink's show and um, Adventures in Reselling, Victoria's show, which was a lot of fun. I want to do that again. I really do. Anyway, I will see you tomorrow night. And as I always say, stay safe, be kind, God bless each and every one of you, and remember to live the adventure. Lots of love to you guys. Love you, Bianca. Bye. <laughs>